Assalamualaikum and hi guys. So today I'm going to share with you how to upload product in Lazada. Okay, so this is a 2022 version. So first of all, go to sellercenter.lazada.com.my okay, and log in. So there are two ways to go about this. First, you go to product and add product or my favorite would be just straight away go to this popular toolkit okay, and click add product. First, upload your product. So let's say we are going to sell this. Once you upload your photo, okay, so you can just choose photo you want to make as cover photo. Okay, again, please make sure it is outstanding and it is very different. Next, okay, product name. Please put in your product name. Okay, example is this. And this is a car charger. Alright, so you select the category as well. If you have a video, just put in your video link. Okay, it is recommended if you put in YouTube link or you can also upload your video. Okay, so next, everything that have star here, okay, is compulsory. Okay, it's a mandatory at attributes. If your item has no brand, right, so just put no brand. Okay, you can click show more if you want to put in any details inside here. If you don't know the attributes, then it's okay. You can just uh, skip, okay? The most important one are those with star and with the word key beside it. Okay, so if you're not sure on this, uh, this is a three pin. Yep, it's a three pin. Okay, model, not sure. All right, if you have variation, put in variation. Example, you have variation in color. All right, let's say we have color black, black and white. Okay, so we have two color, black and white. If you have pink also, you can put in pink. All right, okay, it is highly recommended for you to add image. Okay, so click add image and you can click upload. Okay, let's say this is black. Okay. Once you upload one variation image, it is compulsory for you to upload the white and the pink one as well. For each variation, you can upload maximum to eight images for each variation. Okay, let's say you only have black color, alright? You don't have photo for white and pink, so just untick this, right? So you can straight away proceed. Okay, but for this example, we only have black color, so we can delete this. Right, so there is no variation. Put in the price. Let's say we want to sell this at 12 ringgit. Okay, so this is our selling price. So you mark up, okay, in order for us to do a slash price. Okay, I will show you how this looks like afterwards. Okay, so just remember, what is the most important is your selling price, your special price here. Okay, put in quantity. Let's say we have 20 and put in SKU. Like so, all right, and click apply to all, all right. So it will copy down, all right, and it will take the variation color here. Okay, taxes, just put default, all right. There is no other option, just put default, all right. Okay, scroll down, and we are at the description part. Okay, at the description part, there are two ways to do it. So one is rich tax, and another one is lorry kit. Okay, for this round, I will show you how to do rich tax. Okay, I will have another separate video on lorry kit afterwards. Okay, so for description, just get a description for your from your supplier and just put it here. Make it tidier. Okay, so done. Click apply. Package weight. Okay, package weight. Put in the weight and put in package dimension. And then is this a dangerous good? If it's not, just take none. Okay, if it's a dangerous good, please declare and you click submit. That's all. After you are done, there's three ways okay, to edit your product. Okay, first is immediately after you submit, you can click manage product one. Okay. Second way is you go to product and you click manage product here. Or my favorite one would be at the popular toolkit. You click manage product here. Okay. If you click, okay, just close this first. Okay, if you click the product name, it will go to your listing. Okay, so this is the slash price that I'm talking about. We want to, to give the impression that we are giving out discount. Okay, ultimately, what is the most important is what is your selling price, which is 12 ringgit. Okay, and then when you scroll down, you will see this is our product description just now.
Okay, it is different from lorry kit. So I'm going to show you uh, right after this video how we do lorry kit. Okay, how to edit. Okay, you will see the word edit on the right hand side here. Okay, please do not click the product name. If you click the product name again, it will pop up the, the shopping page. Okay, so you go to edit. This is where you want to edit. Okay, so if you want to edit anything, just do it here. Alright, okay. So before we end, okay, please make sure your content score is excellent. How to make it excellent is by adding one photo inside here. Okay, and by adding photo does not mean that you are doing lorry kit. Okay, it's just a photo and it's already become excellent. Okay, always target for excellent. Excellent means you are uh, meeting minimum requirement. Minimum, okay, minimum requirement that's set by Lazada. Alright, so click submit. So how it will look like after you refresh this, okay, so there will be a pop-up of photo here. Alright, and this is not lorry kit yet, okay, this is not lorry kit yet. That's it from me, okay, how to upload your first product. Alright, thank you and see you on the next video where we're going to teach you on how to do lorry kit. Thank you.